A very pleasant good afternoon ladies and gentlemen. Welcome once again to Big Stone Television. As you know, the journey continues. The journey of those great ones, those who are still here with us as icon slash legend and those who have gone too soon. Today, we're gonna be talking about the legendary Tinga Stewart. And also ladies and gentlemen, I want to dedicate this tribute to Tinga Stewart, to his wife, Andrea Stewart. As you know, she passed away on the 5th of May, 2022, and she'll be buried on the 13th of June, 2022, at the New Life Assembly of God, 148-150 Canton Spring Road, Kingston 8, the funeral service starts at 10 a.m. So let's go into the life of an icon. Tinga Stewart, born Neville Stewart, in 1955 in Kingston, Jamaica, is a reggae singer. Stewart won the festival song contest three times, twice as a singer and once as a songwriter. Stewart's career began in the late 1960s, his first single being 1969, She's Gone with Ernest Wilson of the Clarendonians. He worked with producer Derek Ariat in the early 1970s with releases such as Hear That Train and perform on the PNP bandwagon in 1971 in support of Michael Manley election campaign. He sang with the Wildcats, Byron Lee and the Dragoneers, and the Barris Gardner happening. Then went solo and had a local hit in 1973 with Funny Feelings and won the 1974 festival contest with Ernest Smith Play the Music, which went on to become a hit in both the Jamaican chart and the United Kingdom reggae chart. The following year, Tinga wrote Hooray Festival with Willie Lindo, the entry song by his brother Roman Stewart, which also won. This success led to releases in the UK on the Opal label, but the brothers' festival success hampered their early careers, with them being regarded as festival singer. And Tinga stated in 2012, I almost lost my career to festival. People were characterizing me as a festival song singer once. I couldn't get any shows because of my involvement. It took me 15 albums to fully win back my fan base. Tinga was involved in the mid to late 1970s with the Wildflower Project with Light Chalmers and Ernie Smith and worked extensively on the Jamaican hotel circuit. But his career began to take off again in the late 1970s with singles recorded at Channel One Studio, including Dry Up Your Tears and Rainy Night in Georgia, and winning the festival song contest again in 1981 with No Way No Better Than Yard, and the same year being voted the most popular reggae artist in Jamaica. Two albums followed on Jan Carroll's Calabash label. Singles such as Gypsy Rasta, Key to Your Heart, and A Virgin of Red, Red Wine were followed by what is often considered the first genuine combination single. Take Time to Know, recorded with DJ Ninja Man. The combination singles continued with Knockout Batty with Tinga Love and I Wanna Take You Home with Little Twitch with the album Tinga Stewart with the dancehall DJs following. Stewart took part in the Reggae Sunsplash World Tour in 1989, touring Japan. He continued to record in the 1990s and 2000s, having now released over 200 singles and has toured the United States, Canada, Japan, England and Africa as well as working as a producer. Some of the albums to Tinga Stewart archive is I Feel the Music 
1981. Key to Your Heart, 1984. Respect Me, 1989. With the Dance Hall DJs, 1993. Aware of Love, 1994. No Drugs, 1988. Without Love, 1998. Under Your Spell. From the archives, Ninja and Tinga, along with the Dan Saul greats, Brother to Brother with Roman Stewart, Break Down the Barrier with Roman Stewart, Returns with the Dan Saul DJs, 1998, Unforgettable, 2000, Ready to Groove, 2004. Tinga Stewart, a great, great artist. I'm so happy to be doing this tribute to Tinga because myself and Tinga both share the same birthday. Yep, that is July 3rd. So come this July 3rd, I'm wishing ahead of time Tinga Stewart all the best for your birthday coming up in a matter of two to three weeks. I want you to relax yourself. I know your wife will be buried on June 13th, which is this Monday coming up. I want you to hold strong, Tinga. In life, we're in the midst of death. In life, we are in the midst of death. So just relax, take your time, don't worry, because one day soon, you will see your wife again. Ladies and gentlemen, I just wanna thank this great icon for putting in the work, for doing all the great work. Thank you, Tinga, for a job well done. Thank you so much for watching, ladies and gentlemen. Please like and share this video. And if you have not yet subscribed to my channel, now is the time.